Hi everyone! This is Jim and Tracy and that is Jim driving and we are very excited because we Hi. are we closed on our clip house in Eastwood. <laughs> we own it. We Yay. do, we do. Finally. So we're very excited. We're on our way actually to the house. Um, we're going to do our initial, I guess, clean out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And you know what's really cool about that is a lot of times when we buy these homes, the own owners, usually estates or distressed property, and a lot of times the owners leave stuff behind. And that was the case with this one. The owner of the the executor of the estate said keep everything in the house and when we made the offer it was based on just keeping everything in the house because we saw some tools that we wanted but what's really cool is we're gonna pick through all that stuff we'll, we'll document it as well what's really cool is in the backyard there is a shed right that we have not been able to get into it's a pretty large shed and I, I, I I'm excited it's gonna be almost like Christmas morning going in there to see <laughs> what's under the tree but we have the key for the shed we're gonna go over there open it up and find all the treasure that's in there but I mean, it might be an Al Capone vault thing where there's nothing in there, <laughs> or there might be 15 gold bars or right. somewhere in between. So. I'm hoping for a lawnmower. That would be very nice. Yeah. A couple gold bars would be nice. <laughs> a couple too. gold bars would be even better. <laughs> yes. So we are heading over there now. Um, we will record what is in the shed, uh, some of our findings in the wonderful basement, and uh, whatever, yeah, whatever else there is. Yeah. So Bye. see you soon. All right, everyone, we're here at the house. As we mentioned, we have closed, and what we're doing right now while it's still daylight is we're going to check out the shed. <laughs> Uh-oh, <laughs> he's not too excited. So, what do we think is in the shed, Jim? What do we hope is in the shed? <laughs> I hope there's no animals in the shed. I would like agree. Coons or skunks, that would be nice if there wasn't. Okay. I hope that there's some goodies in here. Let's see what happens. And this is another reason why we do this, folks, because there's a lot of excitement <laughs> of the unknown. <laughs> and? Don't know, really. We're going to have to go through it. <laughs> We're really going to have to go through it. Let's see what's in here. Oh, boy. It's probably like Al Capone's thing. All right. There's pool, uh, pool equipment, but they don't have a pool. Okay, that's interesting. Well, there was a pool here. Ooh. What's this? What's this here? Oh, I see a DeWalt thing. I know you're probably happy about that. Ooh, okay. A drill. This is empty. Okay, okay. All right, I don't know. I don't know what we have. Um, we have some type of weird scarecrow thing over there. <laughs> um, let's see. We have a sign that says, we'll work for freezer space. <laughs> Not really sure what that means. Another scarecrow. Uh, other personal property. I really have no idea what half this stuff is. Um, May not be anything. But you know what? We have some garden tools. A little saw. We have. I think it's a lot of nothing. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, what is that called? It's a, a, a hedge trimmer. Hedge trimmer. Okay. Um, okay, all right, bench, oops. A little bit of a workbench kind of thing. A couple tools, all right, a little less than I expected, but. Oh, but I'll tell you what, this is a heck of a nice shed. Check out the uh, level. A level, Let's okay. <laughs> yeah, you're pretty level. <laughs> but uh, we do it's have a, a leak over a, here, Jason. It's a gray we'll, shed, okay. We'll see the leaks up here, we're yep. gonna take care of that, probably put a new section of roof on. Okay. But the shelf shed isn't really good, is really, Really this is a great bonus. Yeah. Okay. Oh, well, well, we don't have any gold blocks or anything, but <laughs> really, we just have a lot of garbage. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> we'll see you inside. We're going Bye -bye. to the basement next. <laughs> <laughs> so we're, we're just starting to get through this right now, and the first thing, and I noticed this before, and I may have mentioned it before, but look at this beautiful uh, table. Uh, it's a router table right here, so you can do different things. As you can tell, the previous owner was doing different things and making little, little, uh, looks like little Christmas decorations and stuff. But we have the router table. We have uh, looks like a almost like a, a Dremel kit. Oh here. wow! Look at that. Yeah, there's no Dremel in here, but there might be one somewhere. But there's like a lot of little attachments. Um, so, folks, one of the um, one of the reasons that our offer was accepted was that we agreed. Um, that we would 
take care and, and remove all items from the house, all personal property. Um, this was a big deal from what I hear to the seller. Um, it was in a state and the fact that she didn't have to deal with emptying any of this basement out. Um, we have some lights on right now so I can just give you a bit more of an idea of what we have facing us right now. There's a lot going on here. Um, a lot of stuff to remove. But you know, we as rehabbers and just, you know, Jim likes to toy around with stuff. We, we saw that there was a lot of really great potential stuff in here. And so we said, okay, well, a lot of tools and stuff, which we can always use. So, you know, for what she's saving in time and money to have to get all this stuff removed, we are gonna end up with some really nice tools and stuff. So kind of help each other. Oh, what's that? That's a um, uh, air gun. Oh, it's sweet. For, it's for, you know, nails and, and uh, fasteners and stuff like that. Okay. So there's a lot of these stuff. There's battery chargers here. Like this battery charger right here, we just priced this out, it was $35 at Home Depot. Just a few minutes ago we went there, 35 bucks. This one right here is a six bay Ryobi battery charger. I use all Ryobi tools, so this so, is probably $75 right here. Yeah, so, so that for you is huge. I can find the batteries. They're, might, they're in here somewhere, hopefully, and then we'll go from there. There's right. so many little tools here. There's there's this little sander right here. It's like a little uh, Ooh, table that. top. Yeah, it's like a little a grinder here. So you're sander. in heaven right now, aren't you? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Look at this. This is like a little little jigsaw. It's probably a proper different name for it, but there's two of these. I saw one here and I saw one over there. So we're going to dig in and uh, when we're done, we'll make a pile of all the good stuff and we'll document it and go yep. from there. All right. Hey. Hi. I found a briefcase. Oh yeah, we have another mystery here. Yeah, it's pretty heavy. Yeah. It's really heavy. Okay. Um, I'm gonna try to. What, do you, what are you guessing is in there? Oh, I don't know. I really don't know. Maybe, I should, maybe it's the other way. I don't know. I got one side open. Let's see. Uh, probably really important. Whatever it is, <laughs> it's heavy. So that was heavy. Oh. What is it? What is it? Oh! <laughs> I found the stash. I found the stash. Oh! 1991. All right. The year my daughter was born. Oh God, I feel like a bad old man here. All right. Well. Wow. Huh. Yeah. Is that consider that's considered vintage now? No, 91. 20 some uh, 20, almost 30 yeah. years. Yeah. I mean, wait, wait. What do we got? 1989. Oh! I bet you our, our graduation year is in here. Oh boy, we don't have to tell that. <laughs> All right, well, yes. that, that I'm going to hold on to these. <laughs> I, that's, I, I got to do some research. Okay. <laughs> Love it. Okay, um, I'm not really sure why, but Jim is still in that oh. briefcase. Oh, yeah. I've, oh, I've, you said you found something? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I did actually. Check this out. We're here to work, Jimmy. I know, I, I am. This is important. You got to come closer. Okay. What do you think? Donald Trump oh, interview. Oh, President Trump. Yeah, what do you think? Oh, turn it up a little bit. <laughs> this way? Oh, there we go. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Oh, look at him. Who's he, who is he with? Uh, I don't know. Huh? I don't know who that is. <laughs> I really don't know. It, that was definitely a surprise. Yep. <laughs> hey, Jim. Bye, Bob. What I just found under the stairs. Okay. It says Polaroid. I don't know what it is, but it's probably a camera. I'm assuming it's I'm some guessing type. it's some kind so of let's, camera. Let's see. Oh, it's very dusty. Oh. This. Oh. Oh wow. Wow. A Polaroid land camera. That should be interesting. Check I know that. nothing about it, but hey, huh, little right. jam. What else yeah. is in there? Um, I don't. That's that, a flash that's a or flash. something, right? Yeah. And a key and yeah. Wow. A little strap. I'll have to do some yeah. uh, searching and see what that thing's yeah, worth. Yeah, exactly. Huh. It'd be worth something. Very cool. <laughs> Bring this back. What do you got there, baby? I have something else here, Jimmy. Let's see. We have another mystery box. All right, let's take a look. Okay. Let's see. What do we think this is? It's uh, pretty heavy. Ten dollars at the garage sale. It was, yeah. <laughs> let's see. Hope I have it the right way. Oh, I think I'm headed the wrong way. Oh, oh! Oh, wow. 
<laughs> Check that out. Whoa, does it work? Oh, look at that. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, my mom had one like this when I was a kid. I used to play with it all the time. For those of you who um, don't know what this is, this is what's called a typewriter. <laughs> And yes, back in the day, I can say, maybe I'm a little embarrassed to say, I actually did use one of these. That, this is, I, I typed on these when I was a I kid. Know, my mom, my mom was a secretary. Oh my gosh. And she had one of these at home and she was always using it and I was always messing around with it. Yeah, this, this is pretty wow. neat. This wow. is this is pre-computer, everybody. Yeah, see what see that's what it looks like. There was there was uh, this is ink right here, yeah, and ink, then you'd ink, an ink ribbon, slide right? this. Yep, you'd slide that over, and it would ding when uh, this is your little space bar. Space bar. Yeah, this, this is where your QWERTY <laughs> keyboard came from, kids. Yep, right here. <laughs> wow. No? Oh, fine. It is. All right. Have fun. Thank you. All right, so. We spent about two hours downstairs and we're not done yet, um, but we did pull some amazing <laughs> gems out of there. I'm gonna start off. We have uh, a beautiful router right here. We have the uh, air gun, the, uh, the nailer right here. Uh -huh. We have a handheld planer. Oh, that's nice. We have two handheld sanders. This is a jigsaw sander, drill press, battery charger. This is a router table right here with all some accoutrements to go along with it. A smaller router table, briefcase full of vintage <laughs> Playboys. Um, was that was that your favorite find of the day? Uh, actually, the router. Is my I'm sure. Find. Yes. <laughs> anyway, the Polaroid camera. That's awesome. Yeah. The, the typewriter. That's awesome. We got these little saws. I don't know what you would call these. Oh, a scroll saw. That's what these are. This is a scroll saw. I have a second scroll saw over there. Yeah. I mean, look at this, guys. Um, we have. This is a, uh, a joiner right here. This is something that you don't see very often, but this will take a board when you want to connect the board. And you can kind of see, I don't know if you can see this, but the, the um, uh, what you call it? Uh, the blade will come out of here, mm -hmm. right here. Cool. So it kind of goes down like that. And it cuts a notch in the side of a board and you take a little key and you, and you put it in there, you can join boards that way. Sweet. Or join corners that way. Um, so. Little homemade boxes. We got some band saws. We got, we got oh, this, oh. Is, this, is, this is my surprise of the day. Oh, Billy Beer. <laughs> Billy Beer, baby. Billy and, Beer. And for anyone who doesn't know who Billy Beer is. Um, Look it up. We, yeah. Google, yeah. Billy Beer. It's, uh, I don't even want to tell you. You guys it has it to do with a former president. Yeah, former kind of. president. <laughs> this is the find of the day for me. I've been wanting one of these. This is a planer. Um, these are very important when you want to build furniture and stuff like that. And so I, that's what I want to do. I want to build, start building furniture in boxes like my dad. And um, Sweet. Yeah, so this is the find of the day. Well, look at this cool little chair over here. Yeah, we got two of these barrel little chairs. barrel chairs. How cool is that? Yeah, we could clean those up. Yep. Some sawhorses. Yep. Actually, there's a piece that goes on top of that. I think he used that for his table saw, which nice. we don't have one here. A couple old kerosene lamps. Uh, so I, I would say that this was worth the uh, the cleanup, right? Yeah, we're not even scratching the surface, so. Exactly. So a nice uh, find. Um, Again, this was our first day in the basement, and holy cow, lots of good stuff. So this was more the fun clean-out day. The work is about to begin, folks. <laughs> Bye.